Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Spickle, and in today's video, we're going to be facing off the best defensive player in the NBA versus the worst defensive player in the NBA. So we've been doing this a lot with other things such as uh, dunking three-pointers. So in today's video, it's going to be actually defenders. So the best defensive player, I ended up going with Kawhi Leonard, uh, a two-time defensive player of the year. He's an amazing defender. He can cover pretty much any position, and he does a really good job at it. And then the worst defender, how I actually picked this out, uh, well, I looked at a bunch of different factors. I looked at a bunch of different sites who rated their worst defenders. And the thing I found interesting was that there was a lot of shooting guards who were the worst defenders. And how we ended up coming up with Troy Daniels is he had the worst defensive rating in the NBA with a defensive rating of 117.3, which is just completely terrible. A lot of shooting guards were actually the ones who were the worst defenders, and there was actually two Suns players, not only Troy Daniels, but Devin Booker was rated the second worst defender with a defensive rating of 114. Point five, which is not good. Uh, the higher it, it is, the worse that it is. Uh, you want to actually get that number as low as you can. So we're going to be facing these guys off in a 1v1. I'm going to be playing as Troy Daniels since he is the worst of the two players in pretty much every aspect. Kawhi Leonard would be better than Troy Daniels. We're going to be going up to 11 points to see how that turns out. But anyways, we're going to go to settings here and we're going to put this on superstar difficulty. The reason I don't put it on Hall of Fame Hall of Fame is just too OP in this game. We're starting off with Troy Daniels here. And look at that, the first possession. Kawhi almost stealing the ball from us. Just right off the bat, he just gets right in our face here. Okay. Let's see. Oh my gosh, I literally... Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, I can't move. Oh my gosh. When I do, I can't, I can't even do a crossover. What is going on? How do I get around Kawhi? Why is he so good? I, I literally cannot dribble the ball. Troy Daniels has terrible dribble moves, let me tell you that. Oh my gosh, I can't do anything. Literally, if I do a crossover, I can do behind the backs pretty much. He's still like, oh my God, Troy Daniels is trash at dribbling. This does not help at all. His ball control is a 65. No wonder I can't do anything. He cannot dribble the ball at all. No wonder that Kawhi is just stealing everything. Look at his defense. Let's check out his defense. It is so, so bad. I forgot to check this out in the first place. Let's go over to Kawhi Leonard now. Let's check out these ratings. I mean, Kawhi's ratings are just so, so good. Um, and the defensive ratings are gonna be ridiculous look at this defense on ball defense 97 pick and roll 97 help 97 98 okay we can't dribble anymore with troy daniels what is i can't do anything oh my gosh why are you so bad okay so we're restarting this again i'm literally just gonna shoot the three right away it's literally oh my gosh i just gotta run away i can't do anything but run all right, so I'm actually gonna be lowering the difficulty here because Superstar is not possible. There's not much difference between Superstar and All-Star. I should have taken Devin Booker. Come on, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, we just got blocked twice, but we played defense for once. Come on, inside, there we go, there we go. We can just blow by Kawhi Leonard like this. Oh my gosh, this is, this honestly might be the hardest challenge so far. It's not like, oh, it's not like the threes. The threes were, were a different challenge. That just took a while. We had to get lucky. This, this is just hard. Oh, get around? Like, Kawhi just blocks us every time. Somehow we score right there. We're up two to one. Now we just got to play defense, which is not easy with the worst defender in the league versus one of the better offensive players as well. Not only is he good at defense, Kawhi Leonard is a beast on offense as well. Okay, we just got to get around. Here we go, get inside. Oh, I thought I was going to miss. I literally feel like I'm playing with a zero overall right now. He's got some speed. There's some things that are kind of useless that he's good at. 
Uh, like in the 1v1s, he's good at threes. We can't play it. We can't get a defensive rebound. We need a three. We need a three. Come on. We literally, that's our only way we can win. Because look at this. How do we play? How do we stop Kawhi Leonard on defense? We need a three. There we go. We got a three. That's one. I'm only shooting threes for the rest of this. There is no other way that we could possibly win this. I mean, Kawhi Leonard makes this way more harder. Okay, we just hit a three. Kawhi Leonard makes this way more harder than it would actually be. Like, Troy Daniels actually is it this bad in real life. It's just Kawhi Leonard. Oh, yes, we got a board. We got a rebound. Wow, we got a rebound. We got a rebound and a fast break layup. His layup package. What was that? Okay, we're up by one point right now. If we can play some more good defense... I think we might have to possibly win this. Come on. Wow. Kawhi is not... Like, he's just good at everything. Another three. Let's go. We're actually on fire. So, Troy Daniels is a sharpshooter. But it's hard. It's hard to actually get open. When you got Kawhi Leonard covering you. It. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, come on. That's no good. Get the ball, too. Wow. We can't even get the ball here. Oh, no. Oh, if that goes in. That was such easy defensive play there. I think I'm just putting up the ball. Oh, no. He's playing He's playing good D. Oh, no. Oh, no. That ah, should have been gay, but we got stopped in our tracks. Oh, we got a steal. And the dunk to end the game. We finally did it. We beat Kawhi Leonard with Troy. Daniels, wow, we went 8 for 12 that game. Troy Daniels, I mean, he can shoot, but the thing is, it's so hard to sh Like, in 1v1s, shooting isn't that good because you've got to get open to shoot. And, like, like look at his shot. Like, shot close, he's good. He can shoot the mid-range decently. He can shoot threes pretty good. Uh, he's got good shot IQ. Uh, layups, he's all right. But other than that, he's not that good at too much he's got good hands but the thing is his ball handling was very very low but probably this ball control right here makes it the hardest because you can't dribble you got to be able to dribble to get open in 1v1 and Troy Daniels just doesn't have that he, like shooting he could have got open Kawhi though those first few games he like he had a steal and block this game but those first few games he had like 30 blocks. I can't believe we actually ended up doing Kawhi's also almost 20 overalls higher than Troy Daniels. But anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this video. Try this challenge out for yourself. I mean, put it, try it on Hall of Fame. It, it, I don't think it's possible. If somebody and tell me if you can actually beat this challenge because this was super, super hard. So try it out for yourself. Anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you did enjoy it, smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're new. This has been your boy, Speakle, and I'll see you next time. Peace. Never in the same space that we started at. Throw the ball, I run the play like a quarterback. I've been up all night trying to make a stack. Trying to get a plaque and flip a dream into a solid fact. I hustled hard for it. One day they will notice. Chasing in the day.